Hello, Assalamu Alaikum. Dear students, most welcome to Mathematic class. Which grade? Eight grades. Do you know me? Who am I? Yes, you are an instructor, Wazir Ahmad Fushanji. And I am going to teach you eight grade mathematics. At first, tell me who loves mathematics? Mm -hmm. Excellent. All of you love mathematics. So, whenever you love mathematics, we should start math. Yes. Do you know that what do we start for today? Very good. We start the first lesson as real numbers. By the end of this class, you will understand what is real number. Okay. Before that we talk about real numbers, at first we must know natural number. We must know natural numbers. What is natural number? The set 1, 2, 3 is called natural numbers. The set 1, 2, 3. Which numbers? It starts from 1. Continue 2, 3. And what is after 3? Yes. After 3 it is 4. What is after 4? Five. Yeah, we continue like this. It means the set starts from one, two, three, and continue till infinity. It's called natural numbers. And denoted by what? By n. What does denoted mean? It means show. Natural number shows by what? By n. It means n is equal to one, two, three, dot, dot. Now, I am sure that you have a question. What is your question? That where do we use natural number? Yeah. Have you ever count any things? Yeah. It means whenever we want to count the number, the things or the numbers, we use natural numbers. How many markers do I have? One, two, and Three. It means I have three markers. Okay? Now, let me to talk about the other numbers. What is that? Whole numbers. In order to understand real numbers, we must know natural number. We must know whole numbers. The set, the set 0, 1, 2, 3 is called whole numbers. And denoted by what? By W. It means it starts from what? From zero. What is the difference between natural number and whole number? N natural number starts from one, two, three, and whole numbers start from zero, one, two. It denotes by what? By W. It means W is equal to zero, one, two, three, dot, dot. Okay, now we are going to understand the other numbers. And other numbers. What do we call? Integers. Integers? No. Mm -hmm. No. What do we call? Integers. Integers. The set. Okay. The set which has negative numbers. You see. What is that? Minus 3. Minus 2. Minus 1. And also 0. And natural numbers. 1, 2, 3. And so on. It means what type of integers we have? Negative integers, positive integers. So what is zero? Zero is not negative and not positive. It means that we have positive integers and negative integers. But zero is not positive and negative. The set of these numbers, the set of these numbers is called integers and denoted by z or z. How do we show? z is equal to this, this, this. Okay, now we studied three types of numbers. Natural numbers, what else? Yes, whole numbers, and the next, integers. Now we sort rational numbers. What type of numbers are called rational numbers? 
the fraction of the form, you know fraction, this is a fraction, the fraction of the form m divided by n or m over n. What, what are these? m is an integer, n is an integer, you know integers now, such that n is not equal to 0. If n is 0, so any number divided by 0 is not defined. Okay, it's, it must not be 0. And we can have rational numbers by this definition. The fraction of the form m divided by n, n is, equal, n is not equal to 0. It has two types of rational numbers. What are they? Divided into two parts. The numbers that after the point, it means the number of decimals are defined. It means how many numbers after decimal we have after the point? Only one. And also, if the numbers 10 divided by 3, 10 divided by 3 is 3.3333 and 3. Because of, you know that these are all 3, we call it as rational number. If you see these two types of number, what do we call? Rational numbers. And the next, irrational numbers. It is very easy, very simple. The numbers which are not rational. If the numbers are not rational, we call them as irrational. An important point. Listen and look. 22 divided by, three, by 7 is 3.1 4, after 4 we continue, 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 it is not clear. When it is not clear, so we call it as a irrational number. Now I am sure that you know that what is real number. What is real number? The set of all natural numbers, whole numbers, integers, rational numbers, and irrational numbers. These all comes together comes together and we call them all as real numbers. Okay, I have only one question from you. One is a natural number or whole number? Natural number. And how about minus three? Minus three is a natural number? No, it is not a, because if you go to shop, you will not say give me minus three rupees. It is an integers. And because you answered me good, now I want to give you a score. Excellent. And I'm sure that you will study and practice these numbers a lot. And uh, in order to understand the numbers, to understand the next lessons better. Best of luck. See you. Have a good day.